Hello everyone, Brendan Snyder here. How are you? Um, got a pretty cool collection here and it's it's out of print. It's this Sid Barrett collection called An Introduction to Sid Barrett. And why I really like this uh, predominantly is that it actually kicks off with Pink Floyd uh, material that Sid Barrett was of course part of and it's got a number of singles that didn't appear on their first album Piper at the Gates of Dawn but then it moves into Sid Barrett's solo so it's a really nice collection of Sid Barrett's uh, full career going from his uh, Pink Floyd days through his solo material uh, in the very uh, early 70s just after he left uh, Pink Floyd and so this uh, collection um, kicks off with Arnold Lane and then seemingly play Apples and Oranges, which is a non, uh, you know, uh, non-album single. Um, and this is a stereo version of it on here. And then it's got Matilda Mother, and that's the 2010 mix of it. So the other cool thing is that this isn't just a straight, uh, you know, from the album kind of collection there. They've pulled some different versions of them uh, when added onto here. Then uh, chapter 24, uh, also Floyd and Bike by Pink Floyd, uh, the last track from Piper at the Gates of Dawn. And those are the first six on here from Pink Floyd. And then tracks uh, seven through 18 are uh, Sid Barrett's solo. And you've got uh, Terrapin, Love You, Dark Glore, Here I Go, Octopus, she took a long, cool look, and that one's also a 2010 mix. Uh, if you didn't know, the um, Sid Barrett catalog has been remastered and re-released with a bunch of alternate takes and things of that nature. So that's where they're pulling that one from. Uh, the next track on here is If It's In You, then 14 Baby Lemonade. That's personally one of my favorites, followed by Domino's, which I really like that. Uh, David Gilmore has been doing a version of that when he tours. Uh, that's also the 2010 mix of that track. Um, Gigolo Aunt is uh, number 16, followed by Efflorescence Elephant, and uh, followed by number 10, Bob Dylan Blues, which was an unreleased track um, up until uh, another collection that had come out on Sid Barrett uh, put that out. Um, but there you go, you got some new artwork too, uh, done by Hypnosis Firm, who of course does a lot of the, the Floyd stuff. And there's the inside of that, and the CD just slides out from here on the side. Um, there's the back side of it going through it. And then the booklet, there's a really cool booklet that's in here. So there's the, the cover of that. And of course you can see, you know, they make it up with the, uh, see the apples and oranges and uh, the, the planes and different things that reference uh, the Pink Floyd and the solo material titles and stuff. Um, she got some really cool shots that are in this thing. You get the lyrics and then all this other very cool artwork that goes along with it. Uh, single, uh, you know, and it's, some of it's taken from the singles, the 45s that were released at the time. But uh, done very much in the style of what we know the artwork on the inside of Piper at the Gates of Dawn and uh, uh, some of the later um, albums but very well done in my opinion. No write-up or anything of that nature, uh, but you do get some cool art along with it. And the remastered quality of this stuff is just superb, so uh, to get a hold of that. Um, and then I just also really liked this too. Again, the, the apples and oranges, the front of that's the apple, the back side is the, the orange. Um, and of course that's revealed by when you pull out the booklet there, all right? There you go, it's a really cool uh, Sid Barrett collection called An Introduction to Sid Barrett. It is out of print. Uh, if you uh, uh, you know hunt and wait for a little bit, you can usually find a copy for about 15 to 20 bucks on Amazon. I had to wait a little bit until somebody posted one of that price, but uh, it did pop up. So I don't think you have to pay the exorbitant costs of some of these that are out there going for 50 and 60 bucks. Um, but uh, yeah, really cool if you like uh, the, the first album in the Sid Barrett era. I totally recommend checking it out and being able to hear um, the, uh, uh, you know, his, his career in its entirety. All right, if you enjoyed this, please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts. Hope everyone has a great day, and I'll talk to you all real soon. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.